Hello, this is Bo Kaufman of Remax Performance Realty talking to you today about home staging. Have you noticed that home stages are becoming more popular? More people are hiring them because they want to get top dollar for their home. The reason home staging works is that because home stagers know what buyers are looking for and they help you pay attention to the details of your home so that buyers can fall in love with it immediately. Here are the top eight things that home stagers know. Number one, buyers fall in love with their first impression. If the front of your house looks great, you've likely seen people drive by over and over again when there's a for sale sign in front of the house. They finally come to see the inside for themselves because they've already fallen in love with the outside. If you see people drive by once and then never see them again, you know that the front of the house needs some work. Water and mow the grass regularly, add some potted plants or flowers and clean up the driveway. You'll find these small details can make a big difference. Item number two, buyers want to feel like they can move in immediately. Wild or overly bright paint colors do not appeal to everyone. You may love that zebra border along the top of the walls, but it's not everyone's taste, so get rid of it. Paint the walls a neutral color that most people can live with. Number three, buyers love light. If the walls are too dark, the rooms feel cave-like to most people. So make sure walls are painted a lighter color. Also replace heavy drapes with lighter shears and raise the blinds to let the daylight in. Number four, buyers feel better about a home that not only looks clean, but smells clean. Make sure that you keep the house clean as if the Queen of England would be dropping by any minute. Remember that people will be looking in cupboards and closets, so these should be clean too. And above all, it should smell clean. If the place smells clean, people tend to believe that it's cleaner than appearances suggest. Number five, buyers do not like clutter. Clutter can make the largest of homes seem small. So before you start showing your home, it might be a good idea to store larger furniture and pack away collectibles and other personal items like trophies. The more counter space they see, the bigger the house seems to them. Number six, buyers like to see newer furnishings. If your furnishings are older, consider storing them and renting newer pieces while the house is showing. Newer furniture reflects better on the home and appeals to more buyers. Number seven, buyers like to see what the house looks like with art on the walls. If you don't already have artwork that has a general appeal or you don't have any artwork at all, consider renting or buying some contemporary pieces. And item number eight, buyers don't want to think about replacing fixtures. If your lights, cabinet poles, or other things are outdated, replacing them can be an inexpensive way of giving a room a fresh and updated look. If you're thinking of selling your house or condo in Winnipeg, give me a call. It's Bo Kaufman at Remax Performance Realty. My cell number is 333 and my email is bonoshomes at gmail.com. I'd like to have a quick look at your house and make some other suggestions in addition to these to help you get top dollar for your home. I look forward to hearing from you. Bye-bye.